In this video we're going to demonstrate how to perform a load test on a battery using only a multimeter. In order to do this you have to have a multimeter that's got a min-max function. As you can see the min-max button there indicates that this uh, meter has that function. So initially we'll turn the meter on to the uh, DC voltage setting and connect the leads to the battery. And we want to make sure that the open circuit voltage or the voltage available at the battery is above 9 point or above 12.4 volts. 12.4 volts indicates that the battery is at least 75 percent charged and that this test will, uh, will give us some meaningful results. If it's below 12.4 volts obviously the battery needs to be charged before this test is performed. So we can see that this battery is at 12.6 volts. It's 100 percent charged. So we'll push the min-max button to begin recording and we'll start the car. Now what happens is when the starter first begins to spin it draws a lot of current initially and that uh, during that initial inrush of current the voltage will be pulled down and we want to measure what the lowest voltage is during that time period and as long as it's above 9.6 volts this battery's got sufficient capacity to start the car. If it's below 9.6 volts 9.6 is the magic number if it's below 9.6 volts, this battery fails the test. So go ahead and start it and we'll let it run for a few seconds and shut it back off. Okay, so now we come back over to the multimeter and we'll push the min max button to scroll through the readings. The first reading is the high reading, 14.68 volts. That indicates that the charging system is working. The low reading is 9.96 volts, which is above the 9.6 volt minimum, so this battery passes the test. It has enough capacity to start the car. Again, if it was below 9.6 volts, it would fail the test, and we would either have to recharge and retest the battery, or we would condemn the battery, depending on the situation. That's how you test a battery using only a multimeter.